today's tutorial we're going to talk about how to add galleries um, using the gallery bank feature plugin that's in uh, WordPress and this page is an example of um, what the gallery looks like you can see we've got a featured image here and then um, these are all gallery bank images have a slideshow effect so you just click the play button and they'll cycle through every slide in the gallery. So let's go through how to add this. So let's log into our back end which is uh, WP hashtag or hash hyphen admin and then it'll log us into the back end. And you can see Gallery Bank is listed here in the left. So let's add a new gallery. We'll click Add New Gallery. Give it a title. Call gallery 2. And we can set a cover image that's optional. It's good to do that so you know um, for reference, for internal reference, and also for an external to show your slides. So we'll just click Select Cover Image. And let's select this image here as a cover. And then to add images into a gallery, we're going to click Upload Images to your album. And we'll just select these images here. You can see the little check mark beside them that means it's going to add all those images. So let's just pick these, these five right here. We'll hit Select. And it'll bring those all in here. Now you can give your images a title and a description. Just put some Greek, Greek text in here for now. Once you've done that, you can click Publish the Album. And now to, we're going to put this code on a page. Well, it's, uh, what it does is it puts the um, the album in alphabetizes them by um, ascending order. So let's find um, our gallery two is right there. We're going to click the pencil icon. Next, we're going to select a single album, and this will display all the images that we saw on our aftermath page. We'll create a new page, so let's select, copy that to our clipboard, go to Pages, Add New, we'll just name this Gallery 2, and then let's paste our short code in here. These are, WordPress has a new feature called short codes, and it allows us um, to add a lot of functionality. All of these are built-in short codes that um, the theme of VEDA comes with. So you can do a lot of cool stuff with these things. So we'll go ahead and hit that. We'll leave it a default template. And what default template is, is uh, the current template, the current theme we have has the right sidebar. If we wanted no sidebar, we could hit full width and allows it to be a full page, full width all the way across the page. So we'll kind of show that later. So let's keep it a default. We'll hit and publish this page. And then we can actually view the page while we're inside the editor. And this is how it's going to look. You can see there's um, all the image functionalities here. And we'll just play the little slideshow. These images are obviously small, so um, it'll it'll automatically make your thumbnail sizes. So there's no need to do anything. Just upload the image, your full full resolution image, and it'll 